What's good, people? Back in the building with yet another news slash informational video for Naruto Storm 4. I got screenshots. So basically, screenshots courtesy of uh, Bandai Namco, and we got some new information. So Naruto will have his seventh Hokage costume included in the DLC Pack 1 Shikamaru's Tale Extra Scenario Pack. Sasuke will have the Wandering Shinobi, aka Boruto the Movie costume, in DLC 2, Gara's Tail Pack, Extra Scenario Pack. So basically, you're gonna get the Hokage Naruto costume in the first pack, and the Sasuke, Adult Sasuke costume in the second pack, as I predicted in my other video. They're just costumes for the last variations of them. Also, Boruto and Naruto get an exclusive combination technique but only if you possess Boruto, so you need to pre-order the game to be able to use Boruto, so it's a necessary that you get Boruto. Alright, so looking at these screenshots, uh, if we actually go through them, pretty dope just seeing the costumes in, in effect. Because we got Boruto throwing the vanishing ball Rasengan that he did in the movie, we got Sawada fighting Hokage Naruto, Hokage Naruto doing Rasengan's. Hokage Naruto by himself you can they actually changed up a little bit of the stuff that happens when you change the uh, costume to Hokage Naruto like I'm guessing this is his neutral combo and the last they actually make the fist on fire or Kurama Chakra the fist is orange but in this screenshot uh, the fist is blue so they kind of change some of the stuff with the new costumes but most of it is the same uh same character but just a different skin version even though i'm gonna be using the wandering shinobi sasuke outfit most of the time i mean hey but here's a uh, boruto the movie uh this is the ogi that's being talked about the combination with boruto i think that's pretty dope like it just looks sick and then we got sasuke fighting naruto naruto throwing a rasengan at sasuke and we got sarada we got Sarada again. Who and then Wandering Shinobi Sasuke, aka Adult Sasuke, doing his the last combos as I predicted. And then we got him in the Ultimate Jutsu. Like I said before, it's just a reskin over the last. So this confers that they're basically D uh, DLC costumes only. So tell me you guys' thoughts. They're confirmed costumes only now, so you can go ahead and cry. But I don't care. They kind of added slight different slight edits to the characters to make them not exactly the same but they look dope dude so i mean because you got sasuke's hair is changed it's not wrapped up like they changed a whole bunch of stuff so i mean it just looks crispy in my opinion so uh again i'm, pr I'm pressing this question are you guys okay with them being just costumes instead of full characters personally i don't care because they've still edited them a little bit so i don't really care Tell me that down in the comments. Thank you guys for watching and prepare for Storm 4. Alright, I'm out this.